So first of all, you're just gonna take your bag and flatten it out. And you're just gonna take a small little hole. You don't want it very big or else it's just going to squirt everywhere. You just snip that off and you're going to outline. You wanna make sure you pull away from the cookie and let the icing fall where you need to go. You need to go slow. You're just going to make that and then you're going to fill it in. You're gonna squeeze harder. When you fill in, you're gonna go right next to the border. And you wanna have your cookie on a paper towel. So we're gonna fill that in. Just like that. And you're just gonna give it a little bit of a shake. Or if you have a toothpick and you have any little bubbles, you can smooth them out. But don't put your finger in it, give it a little shake, tap it down. And you're gonna take your little package of sanding sugar, which is the brown color. And this is why you wanna have it on a paper towel. You're just going to shake that on to the cookie over the icing. So, and you can pour that all on there. And then you're just going to tap that off. Okay. And then you can take your paper towel and and um, shake it off in the sink or something, or you can shake it off over the garbage. And then you're gonna wanna let this dry for maybe like five minutes. I'm gonna let that dry. And you're gonna go ahead and pipe the stem. The outline of the acorn. And you don't have to go all the way to the edge. It's probably best if you've never decorated before to not go to the edge. And the reason you want that to dry is just so you have definition from the different parts. So we'll fill in the stem and you can leave it that color. Or if you want, you could put the, if you had any remaining sprinkles that could go on top of there too. Then you're just gonna come back in and fill in So I'll just take a toothpick and move out any of the spots that aren't quite to the edge. And there you have a cute little acorn cookie. And you also have either you'll have one of these, either a leaf or a little acorn in the gray or the goldish, yellowish color. And you can, whichever one you have, you can just pick that up and place that onto the acorn. I'm gonna put it right here. Okay. And there you go, it's super cute. And here's what it looks like with the leaf option.